hey guys welcome back to the channel so in today's video we will learn how to roll back from mac os ventura beta to mac os monterey so considering the next version of mac os is a beta uh, you are at least curious to know what it looks like but what do you want to do when you no longer want to use uh, mac os ventura beta so in this video i will uh, share some methods that you can use to roll back from mac os ventura beta to mac os monterey so uh, let me first tell you my experience with macOS Ventura. Uh, there are a lot of bugs uh, considering, uh, let's say I'm uh, restarting my macOS anytime. So every time I restart my macOS, uh, the system pops up, uh, pops up a message that saying uh, that my macOS uh, is facing some issues and I have to continuously keep ignoring the messages. Uh, then considering uh, about changing my wallpaper, uh, that's a bit tricky and the wallpapers are not changing as per they should so uh, these are very small uh, issues with mac os uh, ventura beta so for now i am planning to switch to uh, mac os uh, the back to my mac os monterey so as you can see i have already installed mac os ventura 13.0 so the first step uh, to roll back to mac os uh, monterey is that you have to go to your system settings and you have to search for update <clears throat> in the first step uh, we will leave the mac os uh, beta program so once you are uh, on your uh, software update page you simply need to click details and go to defaults and enter your password so this is the easiest way to leave the mac os beta program so with this you can turn off the beta software updates in your mac os but it will not remove the beta from your computer if you keep if you want to keep getting updates after turning off the beta you'll have to re-enroll in the program and wait for the next public release so this was the first step uh, now coming back to the second step uh, how we should move to mac os monterey so basically there are three steps that we can use uh, first we can reinstall mac os monterey via recovery mode of your mac os system then the second one is via time machine and third one is by creating a bootable drive so uh, uh, there are many blogs that you can browse through and you can see there are a lot of ways to simply download your mac os monterey and revert back uh, but i have tried all those methods and they are actually not working on mac os monterey uh, mac os ventura uh, let me show you uh, what uh, what's the issue main issue so let's say i want to download my quest monterey uh, directly so if i if i click and go to the play store and when i click get nothing is happening or nothing pops up so that i can download or install the mac os monterey version so let's say if i want to go down a little bit and i want to install a previous version mm, let's say I want to install macOS Big Sur I want to revert to macOS Big Sur so if I'm again going to the Apple store page of macOS Big Sur and I click get it should pop up on my software update settings but it is not popping out so I think this is one of the major uh, drawbacks of macOS Ventura so this method uh, will not work uh, if you want to downgrade your system so the methods that are left uh, are the ones that I shared so the first method is by using uh, a recovery system of your mac os and the second one is your time machine and the third one is by using a bootable drive so uh, you have to simply uh, restart your mac os and simply select Control shift and r So now simply connect your Mac to your internet connection and make sure you have an uh, have a good internet connection as the new files will be the new Mac OS Monterey files will be downloaded and it might take a while if your internet is slow. So if you want to restore with your time machine, uh, make sure you already have a backup of your mac os system so that you can restore it with your time machine 
so the recovery is starting and it is taking a little while so now the recovery mode is starting so finally the recovery mode is here so the first option says that uh, you can restore it with your time machine and you can simply click continue and you can simply insert your hard disk where you have stored your backup and you can simply select and proceed with the restoration uh, the next step is uh, the next way is by simply reinstalling the mac os monterey and you can simply select this option click continue and this will uh, download the mac os monterey files from internet and simply install it on your system uh, these are the two steps uh, the third one is by creating a bootable mac os monterey bootable device and simply booting your mac and installing it on your system uh, i have already shown that in my other video and i will share the link so the last method uh, is by directly uh, downloading the dmg file of mac os monterey and creating a bootable media so simply you can go to my website techreacher.com and simply search for monterey dmg file and you can simply download this dmg file so here is the link uh, that you can use to directly download the dmg file and now you can use this that will help you create your mac os monterey bootable usb uh, i have also created a video uh, and i will share the links in the video section below description below thank you and have a good day and do share like and subscribe